Hello everybody. I know lots of people hate this lag when you sp when you shift spaces in Mac. When you slide, you can see the widgets are so slow to load. And when you go back, check this look. It lets me use the app that I switched after a second or maybe two. It's like I bought latest fucking Mac, it's Apple M3 and it doesn't let me fucking use my computer quickly. So I know this annoys many Mac users and I found a solution. And there is no like good tutorials, I mean video tutorials. There are good tutorials like this one, but it's more focusing on window management and shit and he doesn't show you. Wait. He's not showing you this. Immediate. Fucking Apple. This is what you should have done. Let's get into the tutorial. First, you turn your computer off. Once it's turned off, you're gonna start pressing power button. Wait for a second. And it's gonna start saying something. This is in Turkish, but it's gonna say something in yours. And you can let go. It's like a mirror. You're gonna select settings. Proceed. You're gonna type in your password. And what you're gonna wanna do, uh, open up terminal. And you're gonna type in CSR util disable. See that? See that? That's what you want to type in. Then you hit return. You're gonna type in your password again. Yeah, restart your machine for the changes to take effect. You restart. We're waiting for it. Take a sip of your tea. Just log in. Now we're gonna check if we have disabled by typing CSR util again. This time we're checking the status. And it says system integrity protection status disabled. This is what we want. This is gonna cause your mobile apps to stop working. What I mean by that. This is app from Xiaomi. And if you want to launch it, it says your system integrity protection, basically it's off and you cannot launch the application. Because it's not a Mac app, because it's an iPhone or iPad app, you cannot use from now on, whatever. I don't need them. Now what? Let me check my notes. Next step, uh, we checked status and it returned disabled. Uh, install brew if missing. What you're gonna wanna do is go to brew, homebrew, and you're gonna copy this comment from here. There's, there's a clipboard symbol right there. And you're gonna paste here, return, type in your password. It's, it might take some time, it, it's already installed on my computer, uh, so it's not taking any time. Oh, it said, it's asking me something, I don't know. Uh, I don't, I don't want to install it again, it's installed and uh, I'm gonna press any other key, so. You're gonna install Yabai via Brew, uh, you're gonna type in, uh, by the way, all these comments are in the description, you can find them, you're gonna type in install this shit enter uh, because it's installed it's it's giving me a warning some shit you're gonna paste the comments one by one sudo you buy load sa put your password in again brew install jq paste that it's installing again i don't know oh it's giving me the same error yeah shit whatever now skhd this is from the same people who made you buy and Yabai does not support keyboard inputs by itself. We need to use SKHD in order to use keyboard shortcuts. Now, once that's done, now step three, configuration. This, these two commands are for creating directories. These two commands are for creating two files inside. You're not gonna change anything. You just copy and paste. These are for making the files executable. 
Miter program. You're gonna copy this one, copy, paste. Yeah. Once you open it up, it's gonna be empty. Let me empty mine. You're gonna put in these two commands. You're gonna wanna copy these and paste here. How you save is control, like command, control and O. Enter. Control and X is how you exit, right? Now that's done. We're gonna reboot. Once we reboot, let's reboot. Once you once it reboots, we're gonna get the terminal running again. And what was the code? Now I reboot it. I'm gonna make this Chrome full screen. Now I wanna try to use Yabai and it's not working as you can see. What we're gonna do now is sudo Yabai load sa. Type in your password. It's it's started working for me. If it's not working for you, Yabai start service is what you're gonna type in. SKHD start service and it should start working like if if you want to get new chrome and like anything instant instantaneous and it doesn't load the widgets as before as you can see what you can do with this code is you can actually change what buttons you want to change your screen i use the same keys as macOS uses control and right and left keys maybe option and right and left does better i don't know with one hand that then i'm not gonna use two hands for it i don't know maybe if you want to do it that way you're gonna change this control to alt that's it let's do it then copy copy this get into nano again control and k in nano clears the whole line of code what i pasted Control O and return Control X. Let's see. Yeah, it immediately works. That's it. That's fucking it. I know so many people struggle with this. Now I'm just editing the video and I just wanted to say if this video helped you, please leave a comment down below. This really motivates me. Thank you. Goodbye.